Hello YouTube, Empathy Relics here, and today I'm bringing you guys uh, how to get better at Search and Destroy Part 5, I believe we're up to. It's been a while since I've done one of these videos. Uh, so originally I was going to do uh, one game on each map, each of the different maps in Black Ops 3, uh, but I decided to go against that because I don't play on some of the maps very often uh, in Search, and, and it's going to be hard to get gameplays for every single map. So, um, you know, I'm breaking the rule with this one. Uh, this is the second gameplay I've used on Haunted. Haunted is my favorite search and destroy map. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna get into it. This was a very casual game. Like, I was just playing uh, with a couple of um, mates I play with and, you know, I wasn't tryharding really that much. Like, you know, I was just kind of playing normally. Um, using the Vespa, please note this is a recent gameplay. This is after the uh, Vespa nerf, so it's not as good as it once was. I believe I get 21 kills, which is the most I've got in Search and Destroy. And uh, yeah, I, I play really well. So here, I uh, cleaned up the, the guy in the corner first and then moved in and, and cleaned up that guy. Chasing this guy, I managed to pick up the kill and then see the sniper shooting and clean him up there. So, you know, really didn't do anything. Just a, a smart opening route, check my corners and, and just really like the the kills came to me sort of so anyway uh defense pushing down this right side pushing through the bridge um i believe i actually make a mistake here so i push into here to see i clear it out i hear him jump i think he's behind me so i just try and run in here to turn around but turns out uh he was already in there so i get taken out without getting a kill in a round which is is pretty crazy when you get 21 kills so um you know, I'll fast forward to the next round, we end up losing. Uh, so yeah, same same route again. I'm going up. <laughs> My friend's spraying with a drake on covering me. I checked the corner. Don't know why he was still there, but I cleaned him up. Uh, so here. Uh, my friend gets knifed, I, I clean him up. And here I'm just looking, my, um, looking that way. My friend calls out that he was getting shot in the back, so I turn and help him out and uh, clean up the kill there which was just a, a perfect bait and switch so here I try and get the bomb down I plan it uh, towards that spawn which you know is probably the best way I see his ping so I figure he's back here and unfortunately he comes along line of sight with the HVK and I'm just never gonna win that gunfight uh, with a Vespa especially a post nerf Vespa so here same round again going along the bridge like I was just playing this very casually I was rushing their spawn um, here I see two people in front of me and then a third guy that jumps down so here I push up to the bridge a little bit turn around and clean up this guy I'm gonna reload because there's a guy on me I see the ping I slide and he misses all of his shots and I turn on him so now I'm pushing their spawn I do think that there is uh, someone else who may have got through or might still be around here so I check Tiki He's not in here. I uh, reload my gun. It's important to have a, a full clip um, with the Vespa. You really do need all 42 bullets if you're using extended mags. And uh, well, I find that extended mags is kind of a must run. So here I'm checking the back of their spawn because last round the guy that killed me was actually laying down in the back of his spawn. So um, you know, I was just checking if he was back there again. My teammates go down. So uh, I'm left in a 1v2 situation, I got Kinetic if I need it, uh, Kinetic is probably the best specialist to run, so here I go check a bomb, I just peek the water side first and then check the bomb site, uh, guy comes rushing at me, I hear the other guy behind me, I heard his boost he wasn't using blast suppressor, uh, so here I dip, I figure that he will chase me, so here I, I turn around and, and check on the head glitch but he doesn't follow me. So I'm um, here, there's not much time left, so I just want to wait for him to plant and then rush him. Uh, the chances are he's probably going to plant A, but, you know, if he rotates to B, I've got kinetic armor, so it's basically a win. I, I hear him jump, but he actually went all the way around, so it was a smart play by him. He actually does really well this game. I wasn't expecting on him uh, to, to make a smart play like that. I figured that, you know, he w if he was going to chase me, he would have rushed me straight away, but that wasn't the case. So here... Go up top, I pop kinetic, check that, uh, clean up one kill, and rush and pick up a second. Uh, so I cleared out the house, but unfortunately um, one of my 
friends was taken down and bomb is down. So here, I just go and check the back B. I see that my teammate is already in B, so I know it's clear. Notice I don't push their spawn. There's still four alive. They're most likely all bridge side or in their spawn. I've got a Vespa, so I don't push this one. Here I get lit up. I don't peek it. Uh, my teammate runs away, so I just stay in the corner until I regenerate and then turn around. Um, here I try and bait out my teammate. My teammate runs in day. He gets taken out. So I just go in for the kill while he's shooting my teammate. And I uh, clean him up. So uh, 4v2, we've got control of this A building area. And uh, we're just seeing if anyone else is um, going to rush us. I'm close to a UAV, so I've actually died one off UAV twice, I think, this game already. So I'm just chilling. Um, you know, there's no reason for me to run recklessly and die. I've got to try and get my streaks. So my teammate calls out that one went around bridge side. So I'm just watching this. I hear blast suppressor, so I turn around and watch this way. I know he's coming from this way. My friend is using Argus watching the front. He should have that locked down. So here, um, I see this guy. I clean him up. And uh, my teammate calls out that he's on bomb. And I go back and pre-fire it and get the easy kill. So at this point, I'm 15 to 3. Uh, we're up 3-2, I got a UAV and I'm 50 points away from a care package. Uh, it's important that I try and get my streaks now, since I've choked them twice before. Um, I do a, a middle rush route that I like to do where I jump and then go to the wall run. Breaks the line of sight, call my UAV. The guy that was on the head glitch kind of just disappears. I, I clean up one, and then unfortunately the one guy using Ghost on that team, the one good player who's 11-3 at this current point, um, was just chilling back there waiting for me but you know got taken out uh, one round without getting a kill and then that round only getting one with a UAV up as well so it's, this gameplay could have been even more crazy but I, I was just rushing that spawn you know I wasn't um trying too hard or anything so I um, get a hellstorm from my care package and I uh, call it in at this point, I'm trying to get the 50. I need four kills. Oh, sorry, 20. I'm trying to get the 20 bomb. I go for these three here, but unfortunately, I only get two. Oh, it makes it a 6v4. The good player is still alive. Uh, so I know that one is Tiki's side. So what I do is I make a really smart player to here just to wait for him. I was going to go hop in that corner just to my left and wait for him. Uh, but I predicted that he would push this way. I clean him up. Um, I get shot uh, from Tiki's side by a guy with a pistol. So um, I go to rush him, and uh, my friend hit markers him with a drake on, and I clean him up. So all of a sudden, this guy's left in a 1 on 5, now 1v4. Uh, Vesper recoil not helping me out here. And then I managed to clean up the kill. 21 kills, 4 deaths, 1 plant. Uh, pretty damn good gameplay. I was, was just rushing around with the Vespa, and this gameplay just kind of happened. And it was, it was against a reasonably good player as well. We went 15-4, to 4, so ended up winning 4-3. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this gameplay. I thought it was rather entertaining to watch. And uh, yeah, so let me know if you want to see more. Um, getting better at search and destroys. Because I do enjoy making them. And I'll see you guys in the next video.